Hello everyone and welcome back. I'm Michael, your host. Today we are honored to have Dr. Xuan Su from the Dr. Smile Vin Center Shanghai. Dr. Su will be representing Dr. Smile Medical Group at the upcoming 25th Congress of the Asian Society for Vascular Surgery, ASVS, and the Asian Venus Forum in Bangkok, Thailand, where she will also be delivering a highly anticipated speech. Dr. Su, it's wonderful to have you with us. Thank you for having me, Michael. It's a pleasure to be here and have the chance to talk about the work we are doing. We are really looking forward to hearing more. Could you tell us a bit about the upcoming Asian Society for Vascular Surgery? Of course, the Asian Society for Vascular Surgery, or ASVS, is a major academic platform for vascular surgeons in Asia. Sounds like a big event. What's the theme this year? Yeah, this year the conference theme is quality improvement in vascular surgery. I believe this aligns very well with our philosophy at Dr. Smile Medical Group. We aim to enhance the quality of medical services by providing more precise, personalized treatments that improves patients' lives. At this conference, I'll be giving a talk titled the Chiva Treatment Strategy and Outcomes of Recurrent Varicose Veins. Recurrent Varicose Veins, that's definitely a topic many patients are concerned about. Could you share some advice for patients who have experienced recurrence after treatment? Absolutely. Recurrent varicose veins are something we vascular specialists take very seriously. There are several reasons why varicose veins might occur, such as leftover vein branches, newly developed veins, or reflux problems. So it's not just one simple reason, it could be a combination of factors. Exactly. In the past, treatment options were limited, which made recurrence more common. But with advances in technology, the chances of recurrence are much lower now. When it comes to treating recurrent varicose veins, Chiva is a very suitable option. As I will discuss as ASVS, Chiva is an approach that uses hemodynamic analysis to identify the specific cause of the varicose veins and then tailor a treatment plan accordingly. That's great. Could you give an example of how Chiva helps? Yes. For instance, some patients may have recurrence due to leftover vein branches or new vessels that formed after previous treatment. Chiva can address these issues precisely with minimal invasive and quick recovery times. According to clinical data, the recurrence rate with Chiva is below 10%, making it a very effective option. Less than 10%, that's impressive. Yes, it really is. And I'd like to remind everyone, if your varicose veins appear, don't be over anxious. I recommend getting a hemodynamic examination to determine the real course and then choosing the right treatment plan for your situation. When treated properly, significant improvements can be made. Varicose veins can impact your health, so it's important to face them actively rather than avoiding treatment out of fear of recurrence. It sounds like Chiva is a more reassuring option for patients dealing with recurrence. What about the treatment experience? How does Chiva compare to traditional approaches? Yes, exactly. Chiva is also very patient-friendly in terms of treatment experience. The procedure involves very small incisions and only requires local anesthesia. That must be a big relief for many patients. Absolutely, patients can return to their normal activities the same day without the need for hospitalization. This is especially important for patients who experience the recurrence and are often fearful of additional treatments. They care a lot about recovery time and comfort. Chiva allows them to quickly return to their normal lives without much hassle which makes it a great choice. That sounds like an excellent option. 
I've learned that Dr. Smile Medical Group has established several vein centers among five major cities in China. You work at the Dr. Smile Vein Center Shanghai, right? Could you share more details about your daily clinical consultations? Yes, I'm based at the Dr. Smile Vein Center Shanghai, where appointment slots are fully booked every day. Many patients travel from nearby provinces like Jiangsu, Zhejiang, and Anhui to visit us. Wow, so patients are coming from all over. It's our privilege to assist them. To help them, we often skip lunch breaks and work late into the evening to ensure that out-of-town patients receive treatment and can return home the same day. This approach not only benefits the patients but also enhances the overall efficiency of our treatments. We uphold the same high standards as the other vein centers in Beijing, Shenzhen, Chengdu, and Jinan. Allowing patients from all over the country to access quality care—that's truly inspiring, Doctor Su. Your commitment to patient care is remarkable. I understand your team has also been exploring innovative collaborations on a global level. Could you share more about that? Indeed, we have also partnered with the Intellius and the world's leading experts in venous treatments. To launch the Global Shiva program, in the near future, Doctor Small Medical Group plans to establish a world-class international vein center in New York, where we will offer comprehensive Shiva training to more physicians, ultimately benefiting varicose vein patients worldwide. That's really exciting. What do you see as the future of Shiva and its impact on patients? Well, I think Chiva is not just a technique, but also a treatment philosophy that focuses on improving patients' quality of life. So it's about more than just the procedure itself. Yes, exactly. In the long run, the promotion of Chiva will not only advance treatment itself, but also contribute to progress across the field of fibrology, helping more patients receive higher quality care. And with that, we wrap up today's episode. Thank you, Doctor Su, for joining us. To our listeners, thanks for tuning in. Stay healthy, and we will see you next time. If you enjoyed today's episode, don't forget to subscribe to our podcast channel for more discussions with experts on vascular health. Until next time, take care and stay healthy. Bye.